What's up guys, welcome to Bioshock. If you somehow don't know what Bioshock is, it's a pseudo-survival horror first-person shooter set in an underwater city. Yeah, it's an interesting setting to say the least, but uh, it turned out being a pretty damn good game and I'm going to be playing it for you here today. So, um, here in Bioshock... This game is decently old, so I don't know how well it's going to run on my PC. This is not the remastered version of the game, if you're wondering. This is the original version that I bought off of Steam. You do get the remastered version when you do buy it, but I hear it's inferior to the original game. So I'm just going to be playing the original Bioshock experience. So without further ado, let's jump into Bioshock. Uh, okay, select the difficulty. You're new to shooters. I played other shooters, yeah. Bioshock. Adam is the canvas of genetic modification, but plasmids are the paint. Dr. Schwang. I'm just gonna pronounce that as Schwang, because it's way better than probably how it's actually pronounced. Mid-Atlantic. They told me. Son, you're special. You were born to do great things. You know what? They were right. Well, that nice plane trip lasted a long time. Bioshock. Definitely an interesting start, and I gotta turn on some subtitles. And also lower the game volume, because it's actually pretty loud. Well, that's a shoe. I'm just waiting for this cutscene to be over so I can actually fiddle with the options a little bit. Oh good, the water's on fire. Okay, okay, I can fiddle with some options now. Sorry to cut into the action here, but I need subtitles. Okay, are there no subtitles? I don't know, it's, it might be in a different options. So, let me just lower everything by like one. I don't know why everything's a damn slider in this. Uh, is it in the graphics options? Come on. Uh, no, 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 doesn't look like it. Uh, let's see here. Gameplay. Uh, dialogue subtitles, there you go. And, uh, art subtitles, we'll put those on too. There we go. Alright. Oh god, okay, that's flame. Uh, I guess we're going this way then. Okay, the mouse sensitivity is kinda crazy. Okay, I really apologize for all of these fiddling with the options, but I would like to change my mouse sensitivity just a little bit. Okay, much better, much better. Okay, everything's on fire, and I guess I'm going for that, what appears to be a lighthouse. Yeah, I'm guessing that's, uh, that's all the jet fuel that's burning. Yep, goodbye plane. I hardly knew ye. Alright, we're finally on dry land here. Ugh, I'm all wet and sticky. Yeah, I can't, uh, I'm all wet and sticky. Eh? Okay, it's really dark in here. Well, now it's pitch black, I can't see shit. Oh. Propaganda. No gods or kings, only man. That guy's got an interesting face about him. Okay. More propaganda. What is this? A quote from Andrew Ryan. In what country is there a place for people like me, Andrew Ryan? I don't know, Andrew. I think that's for you to figure out. Alright, I guess we're getting the hell out of here. This is interesting. Oh, look at those, like, stanky textures. Mm. That's some good... This game came out in, like, early 2000s, I think. And I'm running this on the max settings, I believe. So that's what it looks like on max settings. 
Science. We have a pod here. Industry. Art. And what's the last one? A big ol' R. Presumably for Ryan. Andrew Ryan. Uh, okay, well I guess I don't have much of a choice other than to step into that pod. No gods or kings, only man. Let's do it. I feel like I just flushed myself down a giant toilet. Ten fathoms. That's an interesting statue. Eighteen fathoms. Ooh. Oh, am I gonna get a little movie played for me? It was a movie. <laughs> Fire at your fingertips. Incinerate plasmids. I am Andrew Ryan. And I'm here to ask you a question. Is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? No, says the man in Washington. It belongs to the poor. No, says the man in the Vatican. It belongs to God. No, says the man in Moscow. It belongs to everyone. I rejected those answers. Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. I chose rapture. Oh my. A city where the artist would not fear the censor, where the scientist would not be bound by petty morality, where the great would not be constrained by the small. And with the sweat of your brow, rapture can become your city as well. Huh. What the hell is that thing in there? Uh, some kind of maintenance worker, I think. He's fixing something. That is a whale. That is just a whole ass whale. So do all the animals just agree not to run into the buildings? Splices? Telekinesis? Mind over matter. Huh. Welcome to Rapture. Use the left mouse button to fire a weapon or use a plasmid. I still don't know what a plasmid is. They've encountered. Please do not turn off the machine. One more minute. The spear. The spear is coming up now. Johnny, security. Find it all. Fall over. Get a move on. Oh, is that Johnny? Death Gurgle. Sounds like a band name. Oh, you're, um, very hooky. Oh, you're real pretty. Mm, that's a pretty face you got there. I guess so. Alright then, I'll be sure to stay as far the fuck away from you as I possibly can. God damn. I think she's trying to rip the pod apart. Ah, my eyes. Okay. Get the hell away from me, lady. Oh, I'll punch you right in the fucking dick. Would you kindly? Alright. Give me a moment. I'm going to turn up the voice volume here. Because the voice volume takes top priority. I aim to keep you alive. Now keep on moving. We're gonna have to get you to higher ground. Alright, thank you, Atlas. Take a deep breath and step out of the atmosphere. I won't leave you twisting in the wind. Well, at least I have some help. We're gonna need to draw her out of hiding. But you're gonna have to trust me. Or even is she? Ooh, what the hell is this? 
It's a Vita Chamber. Alright, I'll be staying away from that then. What's this? Rapture is dead. We're not your property. Let it end, let us ascend. Or do you happen to know a large, brolic black man by the name of Requis that's going to throw a sheet over my head and skull fuck me? Uh, anyway, let it end, let us ascend. Rapture is dead. Okay, so I guess Rapture didn't really work out. Ryan doesn't own us. Attention, all Basvia travel is now denied. Okay. Oh, it looks like Rapture really didn't work out. What's that say? The great something, the great pain, the great chain is guided something something hand. I, I can't read that from here. I don't have a weapon, so if this lady comes to attack me, I think I'm fucked. Oh shit. So that's what they're called. Oh yes, I know how to jump. Okay, crowbar. Well, it's not a crowbar, it's a pipe wrench, so I guess I'm Adrian Shepard rather than Gordon Freeman. Alright, wrench time. Whack, whack. Alright, got a wrench. Okay. Ah! Jesus. These people are fucking insane, I can tell you that much. Get away from me! I'll whack you! Jesus, okay, I can search him. Okay. F. Alright, cool. Bastard. Alright, I think he's dead. Who's this little girl that's talking right now? Rapture Metro. She was talking about her daddy. I'm not really sure what that means, but I'm just gonna roll with it. Rapture, November 5th, 1946. One man's vision, mankind's salvation. Fuck your city. It sucks. <laughs> Alright, is there anything? Uh, a pep bar. I can eat it. Health and Eve gain from Pep Bar. What's this, M? A bag of delicious potato chips will give you a small amount of health. Use all food and drink. They are consumed immediately when pick up. Well, I don't really need it right now, so I think I'll slide on the bag of chips. Numo. I don't know what that means. Door control is busted, so... Oh. I'm not sure what that means, what I just pulled up there. So I'm just going to ignore it until it's explained. Plasmids. I still don't know what those are. Open plasmids. Can I get a plasmid? Ooh, what's this? Electrobolt. <laughs> yeah, just find a random needle and just shove it right into your arm. This doesn't seem like a pleasurable experience. Oh shit. Uh, like my idiot self just fell off. This little fish looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he's still got some Adam on. I don't know what that means. What's with the rabbit mask, man? Okay, I guess I'm gonna meet the daddy. Oh. Well, I see why they call you a big daddy. Look, Mr. Bubbles. It's an angel. 
I can see light coming from his belly. I'd rather not. Wait a minute. He's still breathing. It's all right. I know he'll be an angel soon. How about you eat dick? Go away. I'm not gonna be an angel because I'm the protagonist, damn it. Well, it looks like they ignored me. You all right, boy? First time plasma's a real kick from a mule. Okay. Oh. Lightning! Alright, we have lightning. How do I activate my plasmid? Okay, here I can switch weapons, I guess. Is the plasmid bound to any, like, key bindings? Or do I have to bind it? Well, I guess that's how I'm going to be switching weapons from now on. Oh, I have electric hand. Well, I guess I'm Zeus now. I have the power of Zeus. Use electro bolt on the door switch to override it. Okay. Is there anything more in here I could yoink? Uh, I don't know if I hit the switch the first time. I don't think I did. Alright. Oh, I had to use up more of that. Oh, shit. Okay, getting rocked around here. Oh, damn. Uh, I better get out of here before it floods. Yeah. Uh, get out of here. Uh, this is not good. Fish. Come on, open the door. Alright, let's get the hell away from that. Oh, it's right mouse button. Okay. That, that's good. Uh, Eve Hypno. Okay, so I guess that will give me more juice. I don't think I need it right now, though. Getting more Eve and more medkit. Splicer! Give him the combo! Zap him, then whack him! One-two punch! Remember, the one-two punch! Okay, zap him and whack him. I got it. Where's that splicer? Are you that splicer? Oh, you're the splicer. Ah. Ah. Alright. I gotcha. Okay. Ah! So it's automatically used. If I run out of juice. Get the hell out of here, you damn splicer. Gotta make sure they're dead. Oh, alright, one-two punch seems like a good strategy, so I guess I'll just keep doing that. More Eve Hypno. And another first aid kit. Can never be too sure regarding these people. Gotta make sure they're dead, you know? With their wacky ragdoll physics and all. Okay. Airlock active. Not anymore. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. No, please. I guess he didn't live. Christ. You are on fire. I just want to talk to some. Go away. No, you are on fire, good sir. Jesus. Okay. Accidentally pressed F. They got lead pipes and shit. Uh, what a bunch of fucking nerds, right? I got a pipe wrench, so therefore I am superior. I really like the level design in this game. That's some interesting noises that makes. Alright. Guess I'm in here. Yeah, pretty much. You are the only hope I'll ever see my wife and child again. Go to Neptune's bounty. Find my family, please. All right, this guy wants me to find his family. Ooh. Okay, so I followed the arrow to tell me where to go, so I'm not gonna go there. Uh, first aid kit. Crunchy bar. I'll save it. In loving memory. Uh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Wait. This has happened before, and not. 
Ooh, is that a gun? Plasmids changed everything. They destroyed our bodies, our minds. We couldn't handle it. Best friends butchering one another. Babies strangled in cribs. The whole city went to hell. Okay, is it just me or is the FOV like really close? Oh, uh, can I change the FOV? FOV, yes. Is there any way I can change the FOV? No, it's really not looking like it. Hmm. It's just that the, it seems like really close is all. Oh well, I guess we'll just have this gun like right next to our face for the time being until I can figure out how to change the FOV. Uh, Masquerade Ball, 1959. Uh, cocktail Lounge. Oh, I have a gun now. It only has two shots in it, so I guess I'll make those count by not using them at all. They were in the Cashmere Restaurant. Oh. Can I go down there? Looks like it. Oh. Somebody doesn't seem too happy. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, damn. Alright. Dollars. I got money. I got vodka. Drink some vodka. Oh. Uh, okay, I lost E from drinking vodka. Okay, we have a new diary entry. We'll play it. Another New Year's. Another night alone. I'm out. You're stuck in Festus. Working. To Diane McClintock, silliest girl in Rapture, silly enough to fall in love with Andrew Ryan. Silly. What happened? Ooh, I'm getting shot at. Okay, uh, sorry about that moment of quiet. Okay. I have... I have obtained Merlot. Alright, got a bit more ammo. Oh, shit. Accidentally fired that. My bad. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> it doesn't really tell you how much ammo you have in your gun, so I'm just kind of guessing how much I bullets I actually have. Okay, I have seven rounds. I have uh, one extra, I think. Because I think it's fully loaded. Got money. Okay, so that lady died, like, really hard. I don't want to lose Eve, which I'm assuming is my special juice. So I'm going to stop drinking the, uh... Stop drinking the alcohol, and I won't smoke any of the cigarettes either, because those are probably just bad for you. Unfortunately, there's alcohol freaking everywhere. Alright. Phone. Doesn't do anything. All right, uh, news. Number. Can't read the news. Can't read the daily paper. Oh, I hate it when I can't read the daily paper. Ooh, what the hell? When I walk in here, everything gets all fuzzy. Ooh, why? Too spliced up. I too spliced up. Nobody's gonna want me. Uh, okay, that's a ghost. It's freaking ghost here now. What the hell is up with that? Okay, we have a dialogue. Hey Brenda, it. you care to tell me why you've had a hole in the wall the size of Plymouth Rock coming out of your crapper going on three weeks now? Now I ain't saying I'm Shakespeare, I'm trying to run a respectable theater. I got working folk coming in from Port Neptune trying to catch a little diversion. And all they can think about is the stink coming out of your shitter. Get it fixed. Okay then. Careful now. Would you kindly lower that weapon for a minute? Uh, sure. I'll put it away just for you, Atlas. You think that's a child down there? Don't be fooled. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a monster. Whatever you thought about right and wrong on the surface, well, that don't count for much down in Rapture. Those little sisters, they carry Adam. The genetic material that keeps the wheels of Rapture turning. Everybody wants us. Everybody needs us. Uh-huh. 
Alright, avoid the little sisters at all costs. Got it. Why the hell am I doing what this guy says anyway? I just seem to blindly follow his orders. There's a lock. Oh, okay. So if somebody... Ooh. That's rude. Oh, damn. I think he pissed off Big Daddy. Damn, that guy got fucking obliterated. Holy shit. Okay, don't fuck with the little sisters. I got it. I understand. Jesus Christ. Okay. I got it now. God. You got anything on you? Some rounds. Okay, I can save my game at any time, it seems. Good. It's very good. Okay, I like that I can do that. I thought I was kind of relying on autosave. See, I'm assuming this is the kind of game that rewards exploration. And I'm assuming killing the big daddies also has its benefits, but I really don't want to fuck with those things right now. So uh, I'm just going to not fuck with them. If I see one, I'm going to ignore it. I'm just assuming that it won't attack me as long as I leave its little sister alone. The Circus of Values. I do have some vague recollection of this game, but I really haven't played it in such a long time. I've forgotten like 90% of it. And I ate a cake. Can I do anything with this? Quiet a chamber. If you are killed by the hostile denizens of Rapture, you will be revived, live and whole, at the last Vida chamber you passed. Some of your health will be restored, restored and you will have at least a small amount of Eve. Vida chambers work automatically. There is no need to use or activate them. Oh, okay, so if I see one, I'll just be restored. Oh, shit. Die. Oh, shit. Okay. Maybe I should use my gun. Damn, she kicked my ass. Damn, leadheads. Where'd your pistol go, lady? Hey, let me shoot up with a bit of ease. You just wanted some company? Oh, I'll give you some fucking company, alright? Come on. I'll give this... This pipe wrench gonna be some company. Okay, I got a pistol. Die. You a horrible, horrible man. Okay, I don't know what that is. Some strange porthole of sorts. Uh, a bit late for that now, mate. Okay, yeah, yeah, I understand how to switch between weapons, man. I've been doing that this entire time. God, relax. Okay. That dead big daddy here, of all things. $33 in Eve. And there's a pipe. So if they're in water, I can give them a shock, and then they'll die. Or should I say I can give them a bio shock? <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't funny. Uh, I'm not exactly known for my humor. Have I already been in here? I don't think I have. Thought I heard the sound of a blade being torn from its scabbard. We have a bunch of crates here. Empty. Dollar. Old Tom whiskey. Oh, shit. Now I'm drunk. Damn it. Boink. Okay, let's see here. Where am I going? This way. It's just that I want to explore and I want to find all the secrets and the extras. So maybe there's something over here. No. Trash can. Security alert in progress. Oh shit. Oh, I can see their shadows through the floor. Uh, that's a, I don't know if that's a lighting glitch or what. Yeah, get in the water. Ha 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 ha. You guys suck at this. Everything's going to hell in a handbasket around here. It's Royal. Goddamn, Andrew Royal. 
What the hell? Oh god, no! I'm, I gotta loot, man. There's bodies everywhere. I gotta loot. Ugh, loot. Loot is more important than my life, Jeremy. Don't you understand this? Okay, I should probably get the hell out of here, though. Um, apparently, Andrew Ryan has found us, whatever that means. So I need to get the hell out of here. Let's go. But uh, despite the moment of urgency, I think I actually have to end this video off here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Bioshock. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.